This is a short introduction to the volumetric tomography procedure. Here are the VT imaging accessories. Preparing the bite index. Choose the appropriate size bite plate. Make sure that the bite plate is facing upwards before applying the impression material. Insert the plate into the patient's mouth and ensure the bite is centered. Note the small plastic pins in the center line of the bite plate. Try to get the upper and lower incisors at the same level. Note the proper working and setting times. Follow the necessary hygienic guidelines. Taking the VT pan image. Replace the standard chin rest with the VT panoramic positioner. Attach the bite index. Note that the OP unit automatically switches to VT panoramic imaging mode. Please check that you have the panoramic collimator selected. Press the patient positioning button. Activate image capture and check that the unit is ready for exposure. Guide your patient into the unit. The patient needs to bite into their previous impression. Please make sure that the patient has stretched their neck and check the Frankfurt horizontal line and layer light line. If necessary, make the occlusion corrections. All usual panoramic imaging positioning rules apply. When the control panel's ready light is lit, you can make the exposure through the control panel or remote exposure button. After all movements have stopped, guide the patient out. Check that you have succeeded with the image and all five fiducials are recognized. Taking VT projection images. Prepare the unit for VT projection imaging by removing the head support and VT panoramic accessory. Place the VT projection accessory into the unit and note that the imaging mode changes into VT projection mode. The unit automatically selects mandibular program. Move the collimator to VT projection imaging mode. Remove the bite index from the VT pan accessory. Attach it to the VT projection accessory. Select the bite index position. The lower fixing position is for maxillary and the top is for mandible. Please note that the position for maxillary is horizontal and for mandible at a downward angle. Select the required region, right or left molar, premolar or incisor area. Push the white button and rotate the knob to choose the area of interest. Lock the tray position by pushing the lever down. If your area of interest is maxillary, please change the imaging program on the control panel or smart nav. Press the patient positioning button 
and let the unit move into start position. Activate image capture. Select the exposure values by choosing the right patient size icon. Now you're ready to guide your patient into the unit. The patient needs to bite back into the previous impression as in the panoramic procedure. This step requires the patient to be steady during the imaging procedure. The height of the unit needs to be carefully adjusted for the patient's comfort and stability. Fine-tune the height of the unit so that the bite index is not bent from its natural angle. Ask the patient to hold their hands on the handles. Make the exposure. Hold the exposure button pressed throughout the projection image series. Guide the patient away from the unit. Green status indicators in the projection navigator indicate that fiducials have been found in each projection image. Associate the VT panoramic and VT projection images and start reconstruction. After reconstruction is completed, you may open the VT study and start your diagnosis and implant site evaluation. Please review your user manual for further details. Instrumentarium Dental Volumetric Tomography is an excellent tool for implantology. Please visit www.instrumentariumdental.com for more information.